Physical therapy can be a much needed form of rehabilitation. With 15 years of experience, Exos provides the skills and knowledge people need to identify and overcome obstacles. Creating personal breakthroughs, joining us now is Exos orthopedic physical therapist, Alex Shani, my man. How you doing? Great, how are you? Great day. Great day, great day. Yeah. So, so how can people benefit from physical therapy? Yeah, so as physical therapists, uh, we use a variety of hands-on techniques, manual therapy, exercise and advice and education to help those in people with pain and injury. Uh, we also work really well with an elderly population, uh, those who have uh, fear of falling or have fallen in the past to get them back to uh, their activities of daily living. Uh, studies have shown that physical therapy can reduce the risk of falls significantly and get your back faster than if you would without it. Wow, it's kind of crazy you say that because my grandma recently just fell, hurt her hip and hurt her elbow. So, oh, wow. so how is Regenix with Excels? How are you all different from the average physical therapy clinic? So we work with um, hands-on, one-on-one treatment sessions. And that means that for the entire time you're there, you're with the same physical therapist. For the entire duration of your care, you're with the same person. So we really get to know uh, who you are, uh, why you're coming in, and build that strong rapport and connection to get the most out of you. Uh, we're really highly invested in our outcomes to the point where you know everyone gets our email address, um, wow. even at times gets our personal phone number. So they can call you. Yeah, they can okay. call us. <laughs> okay. You know, they have the support that even when they're not in therapy, you know, if something goes wrong or they just have any questions or want to su share a success story, they can. Right. Okay. So my grandma, who's 84, she could, yeah. she could call call you directly and get her therapy taken care of, and tips and advice. I think so. Yeah. Wow. Wow. Yeah. Okay. And so I think it's important too. So what are the keys to getting positive outcomes while re uh, rehabbing? Yeah, so there are a few keys. Um, the main thing is to empower our patients to have control of their symptoms. So we do this in the clinic by showing people the hands-on techniques that we may do on them, ways that they can do them themselves. Okay. So for the other 120 plus hours a week that they're not in therapy, you know, if something comes up, it's like, oh, I have something that I can do to get things to kind of calm down. Um, another key is, you know, reframing uh, the body um, as strong and adaptable rather than weak and fragile. And I know we can't, we're not lizards, we can't, you know, regenerate tails or limbs right. yet at least. Um, Soon to come, yeah, possibly. Maybe. We <laughs> yeah. hope. Um, yeah. But um, the body does have the, a capacity to heal, kind of like you get a cut shaving, you know, your skin kind of clears up. Right. You know, I know a lot of people have health issues, but there's, you know, a lot of positivity. Um, and a lot of good things that people can do that they don't realize. So we want to really enforce that um, and drive that into the people we work with. And then when it comes to diet, I'm sure that's a big proponent as well. What kind of diet for an elderly person, like I said, for me to be relatable to this situation, my, my grandma's 84, what should her diet be like when it comes to that and those different things in rehabbing? Yeah, so you want to, um, if you're rehabbing specifically, you know, you want to diet a little bit towards that, you know, maybe get a little bit more protein. Um, to really help repair the muscle that may be injured. You want to get good quality sleep as well. There's a lot of research now um, on persistent pain and sleep quality. So something, you know, an easy tip that I give people, especially those who, um, you know, sleep with the TV on, you know, set a timer. You yeah. don't have that stimulating light um, in the middle of the night that may cause you to wake up and then you get a full eight hours of sleep. Wow, shut it yeah. off. And, and where can the people find you in the Tampa Bay area? Yeah, so we're located on Fletcher, um, right next to I-75 in the Temple Terrace USF area. And we're, you know, hopping a skip from New Tampa. So, wow, yeah. not, not too far. Thank you so much. And yeah. to learn more about Excelsior and Regenix Tampa Bay, you can call 813-544-3123, extension 201, or visit newregenortho.com slash Exos dash physical dash therapy Alex Shani thank you so much awesome thanks appreciate for having you me. yes yeah. of course daytime we'll be right back